Most external hemorrhage can be controlled by applying direct pressure at the bleeding site, even carotid and femoral bleeding. If possible, apply pressure dressings to the wound first, then apply direct pressure. The pressure will help to compress the damaged blood vessels and control the bleeding. To apply direct pressure correctly, have the casualty lie on top of a flat, hard surface. Next, use both hands to push against the casualty's wound. Lean in to deliver direct pressure firmly to the wound. Maintain this pressure for 5 to 10 minutes. Never let up or remove your hands to check the wound. If you need to perform other procedures, a pressure dressing can be made using bandages and ace wrap. If the casualty is conscious, strong enough, and able to follow instructions, you can have them apply the direct pressure themselves. But make sure they are able to both apply enough pressure to the wound and maintain that pressure for at least 5 to 10 minutes. If direct pressure and a pressure dressing fail to control heavy bleeding on an extremity, that is, arm or leg, the next step is to use a tourniquet. Cautionary note, do not use direct pressure over a broken bone as this can make a wound worse.